Welcome to Biofuels Academy. This video is made available as part of the Biofuels Education Project, funded by the National Science Foundation and the U.S. Department of Agriculture. In this video, we want to illustrate the common operations involved in a coal to liquid process. In the first step, the dried and milled coal is sent into a gasifier for gasification. In the gasifier, the carbon, which is the main component of the coal, reacts with steam and oxygen to form mostly carbon monoxide and hydrogen. The form the raw gas existed from the top. Then the raw gas is sent into a heat exchanger. In the exchanger, raw gas is cooled down by counter fluid cold water. At the same time, steam is generated from water. In the third step, raw gas is sent into a deductor. Ash particles suspended in the raw gas are removed through the deductor. After deducting, the raw gas is sent to a water gas shift reactor. The water gas shift reactor is an equipment for adjusting the ratio of hydrogen to carbon monoxide. In the reactor, carbon monoxide reacts with water vapor for, to form carbon dioxide and hydrogen. The raw gas is then sent to a scrubber. In the scrubber, the raw gas is desulfurized and the purified mixture of carbon monoxide and hydrogen is traditionally called thin gas. The thin gas is then sent to a fissure chops reactor. In the fissure chops reactor, the thin gas catalytically converts carbon monoxide and hydrogen into long chain terafins. This is the main reaction for coal to liquid process. To produce the hydrocarbons and water are sent to a separator. The mixture is refined through a separator, where light gases, liquid hydrocarbons, and waters are separated. The last step is hydrocracking. In a hydrocracker, the long chain paraffins are heated and reacted with hydrogen to form short chain paraffins, such as jet fuel, diesel, and gasoline. Finally, the thin crude is stored. The members of the project gratefully acknowledge the financial support from the National Science Foundation and the U.S. Department of Agriculture. Thank you for watching. Please visit our website at www.biofuelsacademy.org.